happening today. Crews from the National Weather Service, as Chris said, will be up in Catawba County to confirm if a tornado did in fact touch down in Claremont. Just look at the damage left behind. Homes ripped apart, trees completely uprooted, and families bunkering down to try and stay safe. <laughs> This dramatic video capturing the moments the storm tore through Claremont this morning. That's where we find WCNC Charlotte's Richard Devane and Richard the storm killing one person, leaving others in critical condition. Yeah, that is the situation this morning. Good morning, Sarah. Good Wednesday morning, everyone. I'm here at Mount Calvary Lutheran Church where a shelter has been set up about a half dozen folks who lost so much now right here at the center on my way in I saw uh, power trucks leaving the area trying to make sure that everyone has power in this area of course the devastation from that storm so widespread affecting so many folks including one family who lost a loved one now as we look at video we can tell you these storms swept through the area just uh, so powerful uprooting trees dr driving limbs and trees down into power lines and actually damaging several homes including a, a mobile home area where several homes were damaged one official told us that it basically is it looks like has all the signs of a tornado because in some areas there were homes that weren't touched other areas totally destroyed a heroic statement from the family member of the victim who died saying that he actually tried to protect his loved ones uh, putting his life on the line to save theirs here's what that relative had to say they were outside when they seen it coming and they jumped under the trailer and he threw himself on top of her and it literally picked the trailer up and when it come back down he didn't make it it completely moved his trailer it slung it from the back end of the property all the way to the road it's hanging on the power lines there's just the corner of the trailer is standing and we didn't think she made it either but they told us that she did and now we're just trying to hear news about the baby but he did save her life and he saved, possibly saved that baby's life as well absolutely devastating stories and so sad to hear that we hear where the red cross information site about it if you want to donate also if you need help we have as well uh, of course damage is going to be assessed today but no more so serious than the family that's dealing with that loss of life we're here in catawba county richard devane we'll send it back